like peeing your pants. Everyone can see it, but only you get the warm feeling it brings. What is up you guys? It's Michelle. Whoa, it's bright. So I thought today I would do another like a reading stuff off my laptop video. That explains everything. As you can tell by the title of this video, yes, I am going to be reading to you Tinder bios or like dating profile bios because you know, sometimes you gotta get creative and you know, you gotta get inspiration from other people. Here goes nothing. Let's just, let's just, yeah, okay. So as always, I'm going to be putting them in the screen. I like long walks on the beach with my girlfriend until the LSD wears off and I realize I'm just dragging a stolen mail and, uh, uh, and I realize I'm just dragging a stolen mannequin, mannequin around a Wendy's parking lot. It's kind of sad. True friendship is just like peeing your pants. Everyone can see it, but only you get the warm feeling it brings. Just like his picture. Yay, whatever it makes you feel, that makes you feel better. <laughs> I have a PhD in Snugology. Swipe right if you're indeed ready for this jelly. Okay, that's great. How do you even think of these? You guys are so smart thinking of these bios. I would use them as my own. Oh my God. His bio's not great, but let's just talk about the chicken in his profile pic. It's great, it's priceless. You don't even need to read the bio, you just, the picture is all it takes, right? Honestly, I'm just here looking for my parents. They disappeared one night a few years ago and I heard I might be able to find them here. Please contact me if you have any parental information. Um, I hope he finds his parents. Shrek is looking for a side chick. Don't tell Fiona. No, why? My dumb butt parents gave me a boy's name but call me apples i can fit an entire apple in my mouth what more do you need to know oh and my favorite letter is d for a dog obviously right wow this guy literally has an entire date listed out my perfect date night i pick you up in my kia sorrento you get in there's candles in the car you go is that dangerous and i go yes but i like danger we go to your favorite restaurant and we have a fantastic meal. We come outside and we see my car on fire. You go, Ryan, your car is on fire. Aren't you upset? I pull out a bag of marshmallows and go, no, I knew this was gonna happen. And then I kiss you in front of my burning car. First off, this is, that's great. Second, how the heck are you gonna get home with a burning car? car like but like wait why would you even leave the candles on like <laughs> okay this is a great one a fart is just a tickle that makes your butt cheeks jiggle <laughs> and the picture is priceless oh, gosh i can lift a fully grown horse above my head and i can hold my breath for 10 minutes to settle a wager i once ate a pound of pb folks strongest badger poison and then ran a mile in the nude i cannot feel pain and i can see for two miles unaided by a lens no man can kill me i have beaten a man of every race in formal combat including a turk uh not gonna say that and a rare deep water jew a medical doctor and two priests have written and signed a document confirming that I have no soul. Soul. That I have no soul. Let's just talk about his beard because it's not even. Okay, you guys. Um, let's just not read any more into this because it just keeps getting more and more weird. Wow. I don't even know what to say about these, these bios. Um, you can definitely say they're original. I, I really cannot read any more of these. In I, I can't. But if you want me to read more, give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to me and don't forget to hit on the bell next to the subscribe button if you want to be notified when I upload. And I love you guys so much. I will see you in my next video. I love you guys and I'll see you next week. Bye.